Hi, it's Grace, and today we have a candy store haul. I recently discovered in my hometown there is a candy store that I didn't know about, so I had to pay them a visit. And they have some really amazing stuff, and we'll have to go back a couple of times to sample all the truly wonderful things they have. But for today, I have a big bag of candy and a weird drink. Ocean Blue Lemonade. Hopefully it doesn't taste like the ocean. The lemonade part I'm into. So I guess I should get into this. What's going to be easiest? Uh, I'm just going to pour them out onto my lap. Alright, so in a previous video, um, I... It's going to sound weird. I did a whole video on balls. And I thought I covered all the balls I knew existed. But there are more. I'm so excited. There's pig farts. And bum blasters. And possum poop. These all just sound amazing. Um, spew balls. I think I've got two of each. Yep, there's another pig farts. And another possum poop. Another spew ball. Whoops. Oh, rue blue balls. So that's, that's all the balls. I think we've got every Australian animal covered. Uh, another bum blasters and another rue balls. <laughs> that's a lot of balls. I think they're going to have to be their own video. Um, I got some cola pop rocks. These are little bubble gums as far as I know. I don't know. I really like bubble gum. So I have to try all the bubble gum. And, oh, speaking of bubble gum, I love these. I've had them before um, in little tubes, but they're bubble gum flavored millions. They're kind of like chewy nerds. They're so good. Uh, these are blackcurrant pastels. Uh, I can buy them in other places too, but they're one of my favorites. So I need to pick up a pack while I was there. This is Vimto. I think that's how you say it. And I was wondering what flavor it was. And in the ingredients, it's got grape, blackcurrant, and raspberry. And I think I've had a drink of that before, but the chew sounded really good. Oh, I have a Wonka bar. And this is one of the Wonka bars where you can win a golden ticket to do something cool. But the chances of winning that is so, so low. Uh, this is rock candy. I think it's apple and rhubarb. But I can't remember. Oh. Parma Violets. I'm so excited. I can get these in my hometown. I really wanted to buy the whole box, but I might wait and do that another day. I didn't want to overwhelm them. Uh, a Butterfinger. I haven't had one of these for ages and they're truly delicious. Uh, this is a lollipop called a Licky Loot. Uh, it's got a plastic cover so you can save it for later. I've had one before, but they're so good. I think that is all the candy. And this drink, Calypso Ocean Blue Lemonade. Shake well, real lemon bits. Taste of the islands. I really hope it doesn't taste like an island. That's not appealing. I think I'm going to start with this. So I've got something to drink while I'm tasting all these snacks. Well, not all of them. The bowls really need their own moment. Kind of smells like blue raspberry, I think. Or maybe that's just what I'm smelling because that's what colour it is. No, I think it's blue raspberry. Like a berry lemon. It's really good. I really want to try all the bubblegum things first. Okay, well, it's pink. And it smells like bubblegum. That's always a good sign. See if I can blow a bubble. It was pretty good. It was a little bit gritty to start off with and that took a little while to go away, but it's pretty good. The flavor stays for a while, so that part I really like. So what do we got next? I oh, know, bubble gum. That's what I said I was doing. So millions. They're so good. I don't know what else to tell you. They're pretty true to flavor and they're really nice and chewy with a little bit of crunch. And you can eat a lot at once, which is good but bad because this, once I stop filming, is only going to last me about three minutes. Oh, good. 
pretty. Good news, I tried most of the rest of the snacks and my camera gave out and didn't actually finalize that last video, which was truly awesome. So we're gonna have to try these again. I might get a second chance to be more descriptive this time. So we missed the blackcurrant pastels, which are amazing. They don't really smell like anything, but they're blackcurrant kind of chewy jellies covered in sugar. And they are so good. Blackcurrant's just one of the best flavors. They're amazing and everyone needs to try them. Uh, I think I was talking about Palmer Violets as well. No? Maybe that's just the one I did after the millions. I can't remember now. So these actually taste like violet smell. I have never eaten a violet, so I don't know if it tastes like violets, but they taste like how violets smell, which is really weird and awesome. I love floral tasting things. I used to eat rose petals as a kid. My stepdad used to have to warn me when he used to spray for aphids, so I didn't eat the roses for a while. And then he used to tell me it was all good to eat them again. And I happily went down. Um, I'd occasionally bake them with sugar on them so they were nice and crunchy. Most of the time I just ate them out of the garden. Which is really weird but I still like florally things. So needless to say that these are awesome and I wish that I could buy a whole box of them and put them in a bowl so I could smell the awesomeness and eat them all at the same time. One day I will. We missed this stuff which I thought was rock candy but it's chewy. Um, and I really thought it was apple and rhubarb, but it kind of tastes like toffee apple. Um, it's kind of crumbly, not really like toffee. I was at least expecting something chewy if it wasn't rock candy, but it's just... Oh, can't even break it. Okay, so maybe it's better further down? No. It's just chewy. Well... You start to chew it and it disintegrates. Oh, and I forgot how sweet that was. Oh, it's like getting punched in the face with sugar. Not in a good way. I opened this super carefully. So, uh, yeah, there we go. It was the Vimto Chew Bar. It's pretty good. I liked it. It's very, very, very chewy. And I really want to eat more. But it kind of stuck to my teeth a bit and was weird but worth it when I don't have to try other things again in a minute. Where did I get to after that? I think we missed Pop Rocks. I spent a lot of time annoying you guys with the sounds of Pop Rocks and I think we missed it. So lucky I bought two packs. Ugh. They do not smell like anything at all. They kind of look like pea rocks. We used to have this kitty litter for my cat that <laughs> It looked like that after she peed in it. Kind of gross. <laughs> really flew out of my mouth. Okay, annoying pop rock sound. Yeah, the most annoying sound in the universe. Now I'm trying to choke on pop rocks. Oh, okay. I don't know if you can still hear that noise, but I can, and it's super annoying. But we're going to move on. We have Licky Loot Lollipop. Why is this so hard to get into? What does it say on the side? Candy so fun, it's on the run. Okay. Sweet Bandit. Flickable, lickable lollipop made for bandits who want the sweet stuff now and later. That's a weird thing to put on a lollipop. Oh my god, why are you so hard to get into? You just candy. Thank you. <sighs> yeah, it smells like good blue raspberry. Mm. Why is my hair being so annoying today? Well, I'll eat some more of that later, but so far it just tastes like sugar. A little disappointing. Hopefully it tastes better when I get further into it. So what have I missed out on? Oh, chocolate. I saved chocolate for last. Wonka Bar and Butterfinger. Uh, I might try the Butterfinger. Try it. Open it and eat it. 
I've tried these a million times. They are so good. It's really hard to describe the texture inside. It's like flaky, buttery toffee um, with some nuts and covered in chocolate. Mm, so flaky. And so good. Like caramel toffee peanut butter. Yum. Okay, Wonka Bar. Are we going to win something cool? I'd say not. Oh yeah, that was supposed to be gentle. Not at all. Ready for disappointment. Well, not disappointment. There's still chocolate. But there is no golden ticket in here. Uh oh. That was a bit bigger than I thought it was going to be. It's not that good. I'm disappointed. It's not waxy, but it doesn't melt really easily. It sounds good when it breaks, but I'm not sure. It's not very sweet and it doesn't taste like good chocolate. It nearly tastes like cheap Easter chocolate. That's the best way I can describe it. Yeah, that's a little disappointing. Of the new things I tried, this has to be the most delicious. I really want to know what it tastes like frozen, so I'm going to put some in a cup. It's either going to be a slushy or an icy pole, depending on if I forget it or not. But I think that's going to taste absolutely amazing. Uh, the other new things I tried would be that rock candy stuff. Uh, yeah, no, don't get it. It's awful. The Wonka Bar, for people who are supposed to make amazing candy, that tastes like trash. I don't recommend it at all. Um, the Vimto bar was awesome. Definitely should try that. Just uh, take some time. Don't try and eat it in a hurry because you will lose a tooth. Absolutely guaranteed. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!